hello everybody so in this video i will show you how to interface a cubic air quality sensor okay this is a air quality sensor from the company called cubic okay from china so this is the module it's in a box so take out you see this is a module Yeah, they, this using this module you can measure some uh, parameters in the air okay, air quality like uh, atmospheric temperature humidity uh, the presence of oxygen sorry uh, carbon dioxide everything can be measured using this sensor okay, okay. so this uses uh, a laser okay this is ndir uh, concept so using the laser technology it will measure the all the parameters in here okay. Okay. now my objective is to interface this sensor with the microcontroller okay so microcontroller which i have chosen is the uh, node mcu okay, node mcu wi-fi compatible microcontroller okay this can be programmed using arduino software okay okay so uh, this, this has uh, uart communication uh, our node mcu has a uart communication similarly the sensor also has a you are communication because they are given a pin here see using this uh, pin configuration you can communicate any you are device with this sensor okay this is given here so i have already done the wiring so all the wires have been taken here like uh, a power supply and uh, rx and tx okay here you can see the black and the orange are power supply so i have connected to v in and ground okay black color wire and orange color wire Similarly, the red and uh, brown are our communication wires that I am connected to the uh, soft serial configuration. That is uh, D6 and uh, D7. Okay, I'm connected here. Okay. Now, what we can do? We can. Do. Okay. So now we are going to uh, connect these sensors. Okay. Yeah. So how we can connect is. I have soldered a cable here. This cable can be connected to this point. This point, okay. So we connect it. Connected. Okay. So as I have connected now, I can power this node MCU. It will automatically power this sensor, and we can get the reading from that. Okay, we can do that now. So before doing that, we need to know how the sensor works. So as it does, you are communication. You need to send a certain command. Okay, that command when you send that sir command, what will do? It will send all the parameters and send another command as a response. Both will be in the hexadecimal format. Okay, so once you receive the hexadecimal data, you can uh, get the data because that data will contain all the parameters like uh, CO2 percentage, uh, temperature, humidity. Every value will be in that uh, single data frame. So we need to separate that data and use uh, for our Uh, application okay that we can do using the software so this is the arduino software so here i have opened the code here so we can see here i have a command in hexadecimal format okay it has 1 2 3 4 and 5 5 bytes okay So we need to send this five byte. So as soon as you send this five byte, it will give a response. Okay, that response will have twenty five bytes. So the twenty five bytes will contain all the values. Okay, so that we can do here. So what I'm doing is I'm going to the setup here. In setup, we have uh, begin the bar rate for mod. My mod is stands for the pins where the sensor is connected. Okay, that is mod begin nine six zero zero. That's a bar rate. So here you can see the loop. In the loop, I have written a function. Okay, that function what will do when I call that function? See, this is the function. When I call that function, it will what will do? It will write the data. It will write the data to the cubic sensor, and it will be reading the response. It will be a 825 byte long response. So I am using a 25 value here for this for loop. Okay, so that will how it will do. Uh, after I receive that, I will use certain values to find the C O2 level. For example, for uh, uh, finding the CO2. The I should uh, use the values from uh, array number three and uh, four. This is array index, okay? Because I am storing in a 25 byte long array. 
So in that we have to use the values from array index 3 and array index 4 for CO2. Similarly, for other like relative humidity parameter, you should use uh, value number 7 and 8. Okay, this is for relative humidity. For temperature, it's 9 and 10. Okay, here uh, every conversion is also there. Okay, and that's all. This much all the code example. So once you upload this, it will working as per that. Now we can connect the controller and see the outcome. The program has been already dumped, so I don't need to dump it again. Okay, once again, okay, the USB has been connected. So, the USB is connected, now the node MCU powered on. Similarly, the sensor is also powered on. Okay, now we can set the port number. Port number is COM3. And uh, now I will turn on the serial monitor and you can see the data coming here. The bar rate should be set at 9600. Okay. You see here we are getting all the values like uh, CO2, relative humidity, temperature and other parameters. Everything is shown in this code. This is how we interface a cubic air quality sensor with node MCU. Okay. Thank you.